on the Countdown 4th of July podcast. I do not understand what the White House is doing. The goal, understandably, is to prove its contention that the president's debate performance was an aberration, was a one-night problem, to disprove the idea that there's something seriously wrong. Their solution? To have him do a pre-taped interview with George Stephanopoulos and to have him make two traditional appearances, presumably with teleprompters, at campaign stops. No live events, no press conferences, no town halls, nothing to prove the point that needs to be proved. I do not understand what the White House is doing. Plus, to blast the media equally, it's the 4th of July, the 85th anniversary of Lou Gehrig Day at Yankee Stadium and the luckiest man on the face of the earth speech. We think of that moment in tragedy and in courage. What we don't think about is that two prominent sports writers in 1939 and 1940 wrote that Lou Gehrig was faking his illness and another one wrote that he had infected all of his New York Yankees teammates. The press never changes. All that and more on the 4th of July Countdown Podcast, now live wherever you podcast. <laughs>